What's up everybody and welcome to a brand new episode of Party Chat. I'm Matt and that is Ash. And that is all you're getting today. There is no Dan. He is off sick, apparently. Either that or he's just too wrapped up in playing a division to come and play, to come and Maybe. chat with us. Who knows what it is. But either way, we will. the show must continue. The show must go on. Uh, what we do, do here on Party Chat is every Wednesday we get together for about 10-15 minutes and have a video game related conversation. It can be anything, something in the news or lists. Over the last few weeks, the three of us did our top 10 video games of all time. Uh, this week, just gonna have a little conversation, Ash and I, where we figured we've done a lot of games that we like, enjoy. We talk about how there's always too many games. So this week, we're gonna be looking at our, our game backlogs. Uh, do remember though, if you do like lots of other video game related stuff like Let's Plays and news, you can find out everything we do on our website, thegamerinitiative.com. So Ash, gaming so, yeah. backlogs, the bane of our yeah. existence. I think, yeah, we, we did a we did a conversation, a video actually, um, 12 months ago, uh, almost, pretty much. Almost to the day. Almost to the day, uh, where we talked about what games we have in the catalogue that, that are sat on the shelf, either only just barely started or not quite finished, or games that haven't even been unwrapped out of the cellophane yet, you know, <laughs> there are a lot of them. Um, you know, I think Matt and I, Dan's a bit more sensible, um, whereas Matt and I tend to just buy most of the big games that come out and even though we never have time to play them they sit on the shelf and don't get played for months and months and months um so yeah uh, we thought it'd be a good idea to just let you know you're you're not the only ones out there that <laughs> don't have the time to play these games uh, i think we're very much in the same boat uh and even today i ordered another two games uh, so that wasn't very clever, was it? Which two games did you order? Uh, the Heavy Rain and Beyond Two Souls. And you haven't yet ordered Double Pack, The Division, which you were telling me off air just before that you're going to be getting it because you have to because everyone else is playing it and you don't want to be left out. I know. So that makes me answer the question. So you must have finished Far Cry Primal then if you're buying all these new games that are coming out this week, yeah? No. Have you? Do you, do you see where your problem is <laughs> forming? No, 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 I have not finished. I but you've, so, done, you've actually probably done more than I have in Far Cry Prime. I have not played any since last week. I've had okay. zero time this week. Yeah. I it's... can't wait. What I need to do, basically, really, is stop doing this channel and then have a lot more time to do <laughs> video games. <laughs> See, right. Actually play them while I talk about them. My plan is to make a list of all the games that I feel are either... I mean, some games are incomplete because... I've kind of lost interest and I don't really want to complete them. Ah, but that's not your backlog. Or that's not really my backlog. My backlog is games that I'm really keen to play, I'm really keen to finish or play more of that I just don't ever seem to find the time to do because another game comes out and then I start playing that one. And I've got so many of these partly started, unfinished games that I'm planning to make a list. I'm going to make a list of all the games okay in, so what games have you got right now that you know you need to complete you know you want to play I think the easiest one to finish off would be Firewatch I think that was something that you could purchased. do that in like an hour I know, I know. that's hours. what I mean so that's why top of my list is probably going to go there because I know I can just knock it off nice and quickly it's a good game as well yeah that's one actually I did finish yeah. but on a, a similar sort of vein a game I would like to go back to is everybody's gone to the rapture? Ah, uh, yes, yeah, see, I've not played it. So. so I started that game. But you raved about it for like ages when it was coming out. Yeah. It's it's good fun, but I just never, I don't know, it was, it was, I was playing it one evening, yeah. played it for about an hour, and then didn't finish it because didn't have any time, and then something else came out that week, and then that was it. It was gone. Always the same, yeah. So that's kind of just how my life goes with everything. Like I've got Far Cry Primal. I've played about six hours. I'm enjoying it. It's we talked about it last week. I wasn't quite sold on everything, mm. but it was definitely a game that I was looking to it's got finish. Bit, it's quite slow progress with the weapons and the upgrades. Uh, I would say more so than Far Cry Four, um, where you're just straight with guns. Um, but you know, given the patience, yeah. if you can work through the first couple of hours, I think it does get easier with the upgrades. The more weapons you have, it's a good game. I do enjoy it. But yeah, the problem I mean, is, the division is out now at the time of you seeing this. So I'm probably now playing The Division. Yeah. Which means there goes Far Cry onto the shelf. 
Uh, that's not the only game. The Witness, I would like to play a little bit more of that, although that got very hard, so I don't think I'm ever going to realistically go back and complete that. Fallout 4, again, I don't know if I'm ever going to go back and complete ah, that see, now. I finished Fallout 4, that, thankfully. That, Fallout 4 is not a game where I can just be like, right, this weekend I'm going back and finishing it off. <laughs> you can't do that. Uh, yeah, it, it's like, I need a week. That's big commitment, big, big commitment. Just Cause 3, just, yeah, again, yeah, just, didn't complete that, really would like to. Metal Gear Solid 5, Still I would in like the, to still in the cellophane. <laughs> uh, the Witcher, <laughs> The Witcher Three, I would like to complete. We've talked about that before. I put in sixty hours and yeah, ten percent of the trophies I've got. <laughs> yeah, I played of The Witcher. I played about two hours. Yeah, you got a long way to go. I want to. And Dan is very it, but... Dan is very convinced that we have to complete that game. So yeah. I would love to complete it. The problem is I'll probably go back to it when DLC comes out. So I'll, that will add another twelve hours to that. <laughs> <laughs> which yeah, would be the real. problem Halo 5 is a game I have not played yet I spent all that time playing all the Halos to get ready for Halo 5 but we had we said this we and then I of, played so much Halo I was like right, I need a little break before I play Halo we haloed ourselves out um, I think that was a real shame because we um, we both did and I think we were so keen for Halo 5 to come out we were like oh we've got to get through the Master Chief collection and we both just blitzed it for like months Weeks. Well, we didn't blitz it for months. Well, we started it months in advance, thinking, okay, we'll do a game a month, that way yeah. we won't get burnt out. And then all of a sudden, it was two weeks before release, and we were still like, yeah. I think I was just starting episode two, uh, not episode two, or number two. And then, yeah, I basically played half of two, all of three, and all of four in like two weeks, and I was like, oh, I just need a break. And then I just had a chance to get back. It was, yeah, it was one of those things where we just invested a lot of time and then when the day actually finally came, it was, yeah, I've had enough of Halo for now. And Need for Speed is another one I'd quite like to complete. Yeah. I enjoyed that game. The new Tomb Raider. Raider. Uh, I completed out, that. Came out on Xbox. I still need to finish that. I've played quite a bit, but again, I, I really need to, to finish it desperately. You do. It's really good. Yeah, I do. And then the other game I want to do, which I suppose I didn't really mention this on the Game the Week show when we talked about it. It's probably a good thing, but Uncharted, I want to play the three of them before I play four yeah. but I'm worried of having the whole Halo thing again I don't think I will with Uncharted because I'm not a huge first person shooter which is probably why I felt so burnt out on them like I, could, I find first person shooters a bit of a struggle to really play for long periods of time yeah I, I don't know why it's just I think it just depends which game it is you're playing but um, I suppose when it's the same sort of game over and over as well yeah and that that is part of the problem. Uh, I mean, for me, I don't mind when it comes to like Uncharted and stuff like that. I mean, I'm very happy playing it. But um, I'm trying to think what else I got. Oh, I've got um, the, 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 the the Life is Strange the yep. collection. Um, See, that's good. Know, that's ten hours. Yeah, probably after the, after the hype that you gave it, I kind of felt uh, bullied into into bullied. buying it. <laughs> that's probably the right word. I did actually tell him he had to buy it. So, um, so no, I'm really keen to really keen to uh, to, to play a bit more of that. So let, let's think about this logically then. Until, Heavy rain until dawn. I need to finish. Sorry. I finished that. Heavy rain. We're both getting looking forward to playing. The division is coming out. Yeah. After the division comes out, we've got a little bit of a break. We've got a bit of a break, but we want to play the division. How are we going to finish all of these games? I I am going to put a list together and then I think we should both challenge Prioritize. one another we should challenge Race. one another okay. yes. oh I like that challenge one another to completing not necessarily the whole list but at least certain games you have to knock off so many on the list like right yeah. we'll, we'll pick but that's that, that way saying if we're picking five games we need to complete I'm not going to put like Fallout and Metal Gear on there <laughs> Witcher. I'll put like Rapture on there Rapture that's like an hour to complete <laughs> yeah. I know no, I think it would be it would be wise to challenge one another. What are you doing? It's a fly. Okay. Um, okay. Fly. I like making it a competition. That sounds I, fun. I think that that would be a sensible way to. As long as I win. <laughs> as a, as the founder of TGI, then can I delegate all delegate delegate <laughs> all editing duties to you? So you have to edit stuff. So that means no. you've got less time. No. Oh. No. But if I'm editing the videos... It would be a black screen. There would just be nothing there. <laughs> it's not really that difficult. It's just import, okay, maybe. match, share. I, I don't think I could do it, but... 
Ah, oh, okay, right. There's going to be no news on the game initiative for the next month because <laughs> I can't waste time because writing. That's, I've that's got to spend busy. time. Got to spend time playing games and beating Ash. Yes. More importantly. But no, uh, I those are just some of the games, which it doesn't are. sound many. I think we've both listed about half a dozen each. But the problem is, for the most part, they're kind of not small experiences. Like you, you've, you've said Firewatch is your kind of short one. It's easy to do. Yeah. I've said Rapture. That's a small one to do. But then you've got these big games. I mean, Halo I could probably knock out in a day because it's probably in about eight hours. Need for Speed, I feel I'm probably quite near the end of. But then, when you get to games like Wii U as well, Until Dawn, you could probably knock out in a day. I have Metal Gear Solid Five and The Witcher both basically unstarted. Yeah. Like, I mean, a couple of hours. You're talking, well, you're, you're, talking, you're talking, you know how long it took you to complete Fallout? You're talking the same twice over <laughs> for, for both of them. Fallout was ridiculous. You could probably do Metal Gear Solid a little bit quicker. That was serious, serious commitment. It was. It I was, was impressed. Serious commitment. We're talking two hundred and. Did you get the platinum? Fifty hours. No, I need to get my settlement up to a hundred. Uh, so I've just got one trophy to get. That's the trophy everyone hates. Yeah, that is the trophy everyone hates. It's from what I hear, not easy. So yeah, in time I'll get the platinum on that. But yeah, I think it's something which is there in my mind, and, and these are just a few games, probably ten games that I've listed that I need to finish or. Start. There are probably more games as well. There are. The problem is, there's more I games was, always I was coming. Trying to trying to sign into my PlayStation thing to remind me which which Your games. Trophies. Yeah, remind me which games. Assassin's Creed Syndicate. Didn't get it. Didn't okay. wasn't interested. But I I've, I've got Black Flag and Unity, which can run play. Okay, so looking at this here, yeah, we've got the Division March eighth, and then after that, I've got Trackmania Turbo coming out in mm. March, Alienation both in March. There's both. Smallish games, it's fine. Speaking of Alienation, Alien, I need to finish that as well. Oh, fuck Alien. I played... I've given like, up on Alien. I played like five it's hours. Boring. i still got... From last year, we did our list, mm. and I'm pretty sure Wolfenstein and The Evil Within one there. <laughs> Wolfenstein. And yeah, yes. those are two games that I still... I installed Wolfenstein, so I've got one set of time. I played the, I played the, opening, the opening scene. Oh, I haven't even done that yet. Yeah, I played the opening scene. It was good. I, I really did like it. Um, well, that's really good, because apparently the first half hour is the worst part of that game. Okay. After that, it gets way better. Yeah. So, I, I enjoyed it. From what I saw, I, I liked it. And then we've got Quantum Break on mm. April 5th. So, I basically have four weeks to complete The Division, Murgis Solid, The Witcher. See, this is a good thing. I'm going away in a couple of weeks. I'm taking my PlayStation with me. Sarah thinks that I'm going on holiday with her. No, I'm just going to sit in the hotel all week and play What's that additional games. rucksack you have there? Yeah. Ah, I'm not leaving a hotel room until I completed all these games. Yeah, it's fine. Perfect holiday, in my mind. I think between now and then, the commitment. Right, we'll have a challenge. On video. We'll have a challenge. Right. We will come up with a list, and at the yeah. start of next week's show, we will arrive with our list. And before we start, whatever topic we talk about, yeah. we will have lists and we'll have to agree. We'll have to agree equal length games. I think roughly. so. I think, I think that's so. That's the fair. fairest way. That's fair. Because otherwise, yeah, no, it's not fair if you do on till dawn and I do the Witcher. Because yeah. it's just hours. But yeah, cool. So yeah, I feel no, like no. I feel like progress do is going to be made. Do you think though that we are? Do you think sometimes you just have to accept that you're not going to complete that game and just move yes. on? Yeah, because I have done that with quite a few games that I haven't even mentioned here, like Dying Light. Yeah, Alien. I didn't really like Alien, so I wouldn't. Dying Light was it was fine for what it was. Even to be honest, Just Cause and The Witcher, like, well, Just Cause, I enjoyed them, but I, I feel like I've played Just Cause. I don't need to play Just Cause. You don't need to complete it for the like, story. You've experienced I mean, it. You, you, yeah. you've, you know, you've grappled with the grapple. Um, well, but they released DLC now that gives you now a wingsuit where you're like Falcon from the Avengers. It's like got jetpacks and shit on it, so I kind of want to play it again. Nah. I, well, I yeah, there, there are it. certain games like that where it's like that game doesn't really need the story. It doesn't. It doesn't. You're playing it for the experience and for the the, the gameplay itself rather than yeah. the story. So if you've played two hours of it, you've experienced the game, I don't think probably a lot changes. The challenges will vary a bit, but generally it is it is what it is. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, so once I really want to complete uh, Fallout the Witcher and Metal Gear, which are the longest ones. I don't even really care about Halo that much. Yeah. But I will... I, I will Maybe next weekend, I'll try and complete Halo 5. 
We'll right. see how that goes. This week, for me, Firewatch is a priority. I'd like to do Until Dawn, but I want to make a start on Life is Strange. And so, Heavy Rain. And then Heavy Division. Rain won't be here for a couple of days, but... Um, so maybe you don't buy The Division right now? Then. I may just wait on The Division, just a couple of weeks, but then, of course, we've got Quantum Break, so you're screwed either way. Yeah. Basically, if there's anyone out there that wants to pay my mortgage for me, they can apply <laughs> below, and then I can just dedicate my time to completing these games. And I'll, in in return, I'll stream them for you, so you can you can have the enjoyment of watching me play games. Yeah, there we like go. That deal. sounds like a pretty good deal. That sounds like a good deal. So yeah, apply below, and I will let you know how much money you need to give me and my bank details <laughs> as well. So yeah. Well, that's it for this week. Thank you, Ash, as always. Yeah, cheers, Matt. Well, um, I'm sure we'll be doing another update in 12 months' time on this, uh, where we will still have the, the Witcher, games. Metal and more. Solid, and more outstanding. So, yeah. But, uh, yeah, we will keep you updated. Yeah, let us know down below how bad your game of catalogs is and, and how you deal with them. Do you, are you stronger people than us? Do you just accept that it's game over, so to speak, and move on? Or... Do you still foolishly try to convince yourself that you will actually play these games at some point? <laughs> like these two like, mugs. Yeah. <laughs> uh, but for now, thank you very much for watching, everyone. Thanks for joining me, Ash. Cheers, Matt. And we'll see you all next time.